Hi, I'm Moby, and like many people, I've suffered from anxiety and depression and addiction. And luckily I got sober about 10 years ago. And I know that these times in particular are both unprecedented and incredibly challenging in every sense of the word for a lot of people. I know for myself and for a lot of people when confronted with fear and uncertainty, we tend to try and like grab any short term thing that can make us feel better. You know, I do that, you know, like it, whether it's checking my phone 50 times a day, reading the news 50 times a day, like it's so easy to go down that rabbit hole of compulsion. But what I found for me, at least what works is one hand, on one hand, reminding myself that, and it's self-evident, my brain lives in my body. And for my brain to be relatively calm and sane, I have to take care of my body. And so for me, that means going outside, hiking, exercising, um, bike riding, doing yoga, eating as well as I possibly can. I mean, luckily I've been a vegan for 30 years, so eating well is something that I find pretty easy, but really taking care of your body. But then also, cognitively, you know, because it's so easy for me to become anxious, angry, fearful, depressed. And I have a toolbox, not a literal toolbox, a figurative toolbox of all sorts of things I can do to challenge these negative thoughts and negative assumptions, whether it's 12 step work, whether it's meditation, um, simply talking about issues with friends. You know, we're a social species and we need to connect with other people. Remembering in the past, you got through things, I got through things and we'll get through this, you know, and really remembering that evidence of your strength and your ability to get through adversity. So I hope some of this has helped and uh, I wish you all the best. Thanks.